What is up everyone, this is FNH here and welcome back to my series of me reviewing your YouTube channel, episode number four. So let's get right into it. Actually, no, before we get into it, <laughs> if you're new to this series and you would like to participate, just leave a comment in the comment section below letting me know what your channel is about, why you would like me to review your channel and what you think you can actually improve on. And if you'd like this content, definitely subscribe and like the video. Helps a lot, helps me grow and will technically help me help you grow. All right, so let's right, move right into it. So I uh, got a lot of comments um, in last week's video and a lot of people were really appreciative of the advice it gave like Cal Bax and whatnot. So again, a lot of people in Yo Gaming as well. So a lot of people were really like appreciative and whatnot. And I really like that, that people were able to basically like, you know, take some advice and hopefully I do want to re-review these people once I get the chance. And that would be, that would be obviously more preferable. <laughs> like within a few months or so, the series continues and these people like, they took the advice, they comment back like, hey, check me out now. That would be great to do like a comparison video of like from where they were, where they are now and doing an analysis between their views and you know, just taking it from there. Uh, so let's get right into the comments and, you know, pick out a few channels, you know, uh, three, four, five channels and, you know, review them and just take it from there. So let's see, I actually like to do it by, cause again, for some reason, as you can see, it says 21 comments. YouTube filters out some of the comments. Don't know why. So I like to do it like this personally with newest. Then I feel like everyone shows up like this mom simple cooking wasn't there before. So uh, moving right into, I guess, mom simple cooking. I'm actually going to mute the volume. I don't want to get in the mic. All right. Now. Wow, I really like your cover art. It it defines what the channel is. It, it really shows like exactly like it's mom simple cooking, cooking made simple. I'm assuming you're making videos that shows how to make like simple food. Um, I'm assuming that's like something within that. Um, I guess. Uh, category i guess which is good um there's usually like complex cooking and there's simple cooking and they're like you know people who are either new moms or just new people they want to learn how to cook it doesn't it could be dads or just single guys actually and they want to learn how to cook some simple stuff this is pretty good i like this the cover art beautiful so far um now uh, i see your social media link is there follow me on instagram that's great always have that plug over there um moving on from that name is pretty good now your front page you definitely should have a channel trailer you should being like a cooking channel and like with this type of stuff that you're putting i would definitely recommend you putting like a, a 30 second compilation of you like doing your foods you have like six videos from what i can see just compiling that into something and then boom making a video right from there i would highly recommend you doing that definitely definitely do that um now, going from there, you should have playlists. Let me see if you actually have any playlists. You do have a created playlist. I do think you should make a few other playlists. Like you should put like peanut butter cookies should be like a separate playlist, meaning like it falls into like the sweets slash dessert category. I see you have like a, a lot of Pakistani slash Desi type food because I see like chicken biryanis and I, then I see Afghani food, obviously. So I, I feel like maybe you should make some of these into like se separate segments and maybe even call your playlist like they see foods like maybe target that community maybe that's what you're trying to do and then try to get them to watch your videos i mean obviously it could for anyone it doesn't have to be that segment of people or demographics but again i'm just throwing ideas out there now going to the about page that's great that you actually have an about page you actually talk about the type of food you make you actually do say uh what to do you're telling people to subscribe click the notification bell you have 1500 views you started you basically just started and i think you're doing good you have a, almost 100 subscribers uh i have a new video on how to get a thousand subscribers all my videos that just help you grow will be in the descriptions but just an fyi I have another one that says how to get a thousand subscribers. It has some un unconventional methods that no one really knows about or talks about, or maybe they do. They just don't talk about it. Um, I would say you should definitely do discussions. Someone like you would work out well with discussions because you should talk back to your community and let them know like, Hey, what do you want me to do today? Or it was this good. Do polls. I always do polls on my channel. Like do polls, like talk to them. You know, interact with them. It definitely helps. Now, moving on to the videos. Oh, you actually have a lot more videos. Okay, I just saw the front page just showed the first six. Correct. That's my fault. That's See, that's why you need to have, like, thumb, um, playlists because it would have helped me see, like, the different vari varieties of your videos. Now, moving on. I love your thumbnails. They're absolutely beautiful and sleek. sleek. With the exception of the first one, which I'm guessing is your first try, your second one is getting better then you can see this is this is pretty good the background is great it has that sleek wood background which food channels really like to have you have that in the background you have nice lighting you can see what it is like i can clearly see it says how to make sea kebab at home it's good it's effective i think you should definitely keep that up and keep it like those like some of these maybe not so hot like maybe this one the afghani balani one 
but some of these are really good like the chicken biryani at home is really good uh, i think you're showcasing the food pretty well as certain ones um yeah I, I think your thumbnails are really good i'm gonna i'm gonna actually open up your you actually just up, uploaded this one it says tiktok viral i like how you're taking that into consideration so let's actually open up the biryani one i actually want to see this one six minutes long pretty good um let's see how to make chicken biryani at home uh, in this video, I will show you that's great. You put out the ingredients. You, you're fairly descriptive on what you're doing. I think you should maybe talk a little bit more about the biryani. I, I know it's food. Maybe you can't, so it's fine, I guess. Um, you put the hashtags. That's great. Definitely continue doing that. I would highly recommend it. You're getting a lot of comments. You're resp responding back to people, which is great. You have a lot of comments. Your channel is going to do really good, man. I, I I, I guarantee your channel is going to blow up. <laughs> you uh, And again, if you guys are watching, I would recommend you checking this person's channel out just for the sake of like how, I'm assuming it's a, it's a girl that says, mom, she's doing her channel. I would highly recommend you guys checking her out and even subscribing to the channel, especially if you're like into the food type of stuff and you want to learn how to cook food and whatnot. But this was great. I, I Overall, I like it. So let's see. Um, oh yeah, my two buddy is not working, so I really can't check the tag, so I do apologize for that. It's just tell me to sign in. I tried signing in. It didn't sign in, so I'm going to try to like take a step back aside from the tags and just... I do apologize for that just in advance. So I can't really check your tags perspective, everyone. Uh, but overall, I, I really do like it so far. Uh, I can't speak on the tag side, but just how you're doing your... T your titles and whatnot you're doing really good and if you guys really want to know like what this tubebuddy is a, a video link will be for that in the description as well to find out how to use tubebuddy what to do how to utilize it maybe you don't know what it is mom simple cooking and you want to learn how to grow even faster that's definitely a tool you should utilize um yeah so far so good man i really like your channel you shared more videos you that's which is great to do you put it you plugged literally you put copyright no no copyrighted music you literally put the links as well which is good to have um yeah i this is great this is absolutely great i think you're growing at a phenomenal pace uh, basically 100 subscribers a month that's great you'll have a you'll have thousand subscribers before the end of the year i can guarantee that if you continue doing your flow the only thing i would recommend you doing is have a somewhat bit of somewhat bit of a consistency on how to like uh put out content on your channel and i'll tell you why i say that if you look at your channel you uploaded a little bit inconsistently like you can see a week ago a week ago then it's six days four and then one and boom another hour ago like have a schedule you can even change this up a little bit maybe I, maybe you don't have to do it here maybe you can do it somewhere else but have some form of consistency like i will upload three times a week or twice a week mondays and fridays and then have it uploaded monday like do it on tuesday wednesday and then schedule it for monday and friday um like i usually do that for this channel i most of the time i try to make as many videos as i can on the weekend because it's just because I, I, that's what i have the most free time so i spend like 10 12 hours researching making videos and then i upload the content on youtube and i schedule it throughout the week so I, I i tend to do that again it depends on the channel if it's an easier channel you don't have to spend that much time um if it's a harder channel you obviously need to spend more time and then just schedule once a week if it's a gaming channel you just got to do it on a weekly basis uh, sorry daily basis so yeah um overall great channel guys I'm off to a great start. Follow this type of channel as recommendations. <laughs> this is really good. And the food looks damn good. Check it out for sure. All right. Um, moving on to the next channel. Let's see. Did I, ch did I check this channel back? So I did not check this channel. So I think let's go with ghostly underscore RL. Um, all right. I'm assuming it's a gaming channel. Um, you can see like that's probably the gamer hashtag. It's GH0SCY. It's going to throw people off when they try to search the channel. Um, always think about that when you do a username. People don't really want to do that. Because like if I do honestly want to search like ghosty, I'm not going to put the zero. I'm, gonna, I'm just, it's just going to be tough to put the zero. Uh, same advice as the other one. Put a trailer. Just put one of your best gameplays if you want to or your videos. I'm assuming you're doing Rocket League because that's all I see uh played a little bit of rocket league myself but don't yep you're a rocket league content creator that's great you should maybe put it up here that you do uh rocket league videos every week or every day blah 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 i would definitely recommend you saying that you just started got eighteen thousand views that's pretty damn good actually uh the other person only had 1500 and got a lot of subscribers see that's what matters the the, the different type of content and the different type of genre varies vastly like mine i have insane views but we don't get that many subscribers because tech and tutorial channels and review channels they don't tend to get that much subscribers on that level it just varies so much significantly like different communities different niches different genres they play out very differently um 
So let's see. You're just talking about your ambitions. You're talking about the game. I would say put throw in a schedule in there. What your schedule is about. Uh, you have some playlists, which is good. I would say at least put them on the homepage, just like the other advice I gave. Uh, let's see. From your video perspective, your thumbnails could be much better. They're just white fonts that's not really that good i have a video on how to make thumbnails just download one of those apps on the ios store or on an android store like your old videos don't even have a thumbnail i uh, definitely would recommend you putting up more thumbnails even the old videos put a th thumbnail you'd be surprised they actually end up doing good um, what i would recommend you which i don't see here live stream live streaming will help grow your channel immensely there was a channel that came up on this uh, last week's review or the week before who live streamed and he was getting a lot of views and subs because of that that's when he would do the best with views so I would recommend you giving live streaming a shot you're uploading consistency which is good still have a schedule be like I upload every single day or I upload five times a week and then schedule your uploads like do it on the weekend I don't know what your age is maybe that's when you're free do it on the weekend if you obviously if you have time after home uh, like school or whatnot do it at home later and then like upload it but I prefer just doing like on a, on a consolidated bunch making it perfect and then scheduling it out again uh, to each his own everyone can have their own preference on how they do it but fix your thumbnail fix your thumbnails for sure i don't like their your thumbnails honestly that much so let's see what was your most viewed video um okay this one a month ago you did really good on this video these two videos are what ended up doing good uh and i would recommend you like Kind of like, I know it's been too late now, but you should have hopped on this like trend and continued making these exact same videos and then just going from there. You can see you got 10K subs, 57 likes. Yeah, you got some dislikes. Who cares? It's still engagement. Um, you, let's see. You didn't talk much over here. You should have definitely talked a little bit more over here. I think you should have definitely kept on going. You got seven comments, which is pretty good. I think you should have just kept on continue making content like this. You would have ended up doing pretty damn good. I, I think you should have definitely continued that flow. But it's okay. It's not that bad. I think your channel is actually doing good in, in, from a gamer's perspective. Definitely continue making the videos. Put better thumbnails. Make it more enticing. Make it more catching. And even your old videos that don't have one, put a thumbnail. You'll probably grow your channel pretty fast if you end up doing that. Um, yeah, moving on. Uh, let's go to the third channel. Let's see. Let's see. Exclusive Daily. This person says he does Minecraft videos. Uh, let's see. What about this one? All right, let's see. I, I want to check this. This guy says his YouTube is cringed. Sorry. All right, let's see. He has a live stream up. I actually want to check this live stream out in a second. All right, so obviously he may have a channel trailer, but there's a live stream up, so you can't see. So when you have a live stream up, you new and previous subscriber, current and new subscribers will not be able to see that trailer. It, this is what pops up uh, the most. Now, let's see. If I go to videos, um, actually, let me go to about first. All right, all caps, vlogs, games. Guess you're doing a bunch of everything. You started 2018. I don't know how true that is because people usually just had a channel but never did anything or uploaded like a crappy video. Okay, you so you had Minecraft videos from a year ago. I guess you do vlogs. So let's see. So it's you're like a gaming slash like lifestyle ish type channel. Lifestyle meaning like vlogs and whatnot. Uh, oh, your trail. Sorry, your cover art. It's disgusting, man. <laughs> you gotta fix your cover art. Sorry, this is much better. This font is disgusting. And the top font is disgusting. You gotta fix up your cover art, make it better, make it more enticing. Say what your channel's about, and take it from there. Nothing wrong with your channel name being on it, but I would prefer you just throwing something like what this channel is about, like gaming slash vlogs or something of the sort, and then just taking it from there. Uh, now, um, looking at your channels, you got a lot of videos up. Well, then actually, you don't have that much consistency, which kind of sucks. Because if you look, you are have been uploading like 10 months ago, then one month ago, then two weeks ago. You need to have a lot more consistency because that's what's kind of sucking on your channel right now. Like, you have, like, what, 20 videos from one year ago. Like, that's kind of bad. Your consistency kind of sucks. You need to definitely be more consistent if you're, if you're definitely trying to be serious on how to grow your YouTube channel. So let's see. Let's look at your live stream. I started streaming 12 hours ago. Um, pretty cool, cool, I guess. Uh, what is this? Which, which what live stream is this? Uh, or, I mean, what is that that you're using? Oh, you didn't link it to what it is. Um, I would say there's nothing wrong with it, but no one really wants to see, like, your live stream. Maybe you could share it on Reddit. People will check it out. Maybe it might go viral. Uh, I remember there was this, like, Reddit thing where it was, like, a kid who, um, what's it called? Uh, he was, um... I think, I think what he did he say he was like he had like 100 views and like 20 subs and he, it was like literally a kid and he just said yo come check my channel out and like someone sh shared him on reddit he ended up getting like 50,000 or 100,000 subscribers I am viewing a channel 
<laughs> so I had to say that. So yeah, uh, definitely look at the stuff I said. You could definitely improve your content. Watch the videos I have. I'm gonna leave in the description below. You will learn a lot. You'll learn the one where how to get 100 subs. You'll learn how to optimize your titles, your tags, your search. Uh, description basically your SEO for the whole nine yards and then once you take it from there I have some videos on like how to improve your thumbnails I have some live stream hacks as well um, I would advise you to check that out to see how to actually do a true or good live stream hack that's not really a good one uh, even doing PewDiePie I know you can't do them anymore but like let's say PewDiePie versus T-Series that was a live stream hack that could have worked very well uh, this isn't not really exactly a live stream hack um, all right I'm gonna do one more channel and then I am going to dip uh, cause I'm, I am tired. I'm very tired. So let's do, let's see, Mishika. All right, all right, I'll, I'll check Mishika out. I like the name and I like the picture. It, it reminds me of some anime characters. All right, cool. All right, boom, starting right off. I love her. I'm assuming it's a girl. I love her, uh, channel art. Beautiful. The, your channel art's beautiful. It shows that it's gaming. It may be Pokemon. Actually, that looks like Zelda. Uh, Majora's Mask, That when he puts that on. Maybe I'm wrong. But that's obviously Pokemon. Well, these coins are definitely Zelda's links. <laughs> the rupees and whatnot. Um, it looks cool. I really like your cover art. It shows exactly like, well, to a certain degree, like it's a gaming channel. You can tell. You have your um, you have your Spotify. I'm assuming you make music maybe. I don't know what Osu is. You got your Twitch. Just want to ch check your Twitch out. I'm assuming you're not twitching. You're not. Um, is that the word people use, twitching? I don't know. Uh, do you not twitch? I guess maybe you don't really have anything yet. All right, it's okay. I just wanted to check it out. So you have a channel trailer, which is cool. Uh, you have some uploads. You should definitely put up a, um, a playlist, like I've mentioned the previous ones. Your about could be significantly better. Your Discord's there, which is pretty cool. If people want to talk to you, they can talk to you. Uh, it looks like you started a while ago, but you probably didn't upload any videos. You probably just started again. Uh, let's see if you did. I just want to check it out. You did. A year ago, I guess. So you, you played Fantasy, Fantasy Star Online. I, I don't know what... I, I know what that game is. I don't know what's going on, though. It looks very anime-oriented, which is perfectly fine. That's actually a niche I have not seen as much or a genre for gaming. Um, I'm assuming these are your thumbnails. That's why they're pink. It's not the game. So that's pretty cool. You, you're doing a lot of different games, but I would say do... Do some more games. Oh, actually, it just ends over here. So you just have like 15, 16 videos. I would say there's nothing wrong with your thumbnail. The consistency was actually pretty good. What I would say is continue to like do focus on like either an anime type game or something. Maybe I, unless if that's not what you want to do. Like, but focus on a game that ends up getting the most views and like taking it from there. Like, I, I can't tell a consistency because you have all these different games that you're playing. So you don't have really a consistency of one game. And I don't know if you're good. I don't know if you're trying to be comedic. So I would say focus on a consistency of a game and then just taking it from there. Like maybe just play, excuse me, play just Pavlov VR or maybe just play COD. I don't know, Modern Warfare, like Mexican Life, whatever that means. Like play something once consistently and take it from there. Since you're a gaming channel, especially if you're a female, let me just check one out. I don't know if you show your face or or if you show anything actually uh, i don't think you do i was gonna say if you, especially if you show your face i was gonna say stream do my live stream hack with the, playing a video game uh just to like briefly recap i played call of duty on my gaming channel right when it came out and i remember my i was one of the first few people streaming on youtube not twitch youtube and i literally got a hundred plus subscribers that day just for playing cod and the next day i got another hundred like my channel was just in the, and i did it i only played for two hours if i knew i would have streamed for 12 hours i would have probably got a thousand subscribers a day i didn't know that i lost kind of a little opportunity at that point but when i stream normally now on cod i got five ten subscribers easily in my stream and i do it for two hours and sometimes i get cash sometimes people tip me ten dollars five dollars twenty dollars uh obviously you won't get any tips at least through YouTube, you, you're not uh, monetized. You could obviously always do it through Streamlabs and get a tip over there. But um, yeah, definitely, definitely think about that. Watch my videos that I just mentioned and just take it from there. Um, yeah, I think uh, aside from that, guys, I'm gonna just end it off over here. Uh, I do hope you guys found these the review and like you know this information helpful. Um, aside from that, if you guys like a video, smash the like button, helps a lot. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe and click the notification bell. And if you want to be part of the review for next week, leave a comment below. And on that, FNH out. Peace.